Hi, I'm Carla. And this is Emily of Deep Valley, Emily of Deep Valley by Maud Hart Lovelace. Emily Webster is graduating from high school. It's 1912 in the southern Minnesota town of Deep Valley. Shy orphan Emily longs to study sociology and emulate Jane Addams, but she must stay behind to care for her 80-year-old grandfather. Also, Emily has a bit of a crush on Don, who is moody and sophisticated, and with whom she's had wonderfully intellectual conversations, though he visits only when Emily's pretty popular cousin Annette is out of town. Emily is bereft and lonely when Don, Annette, and the others go off to college, until a seemingly innocuous comment makes her muster her wits and move on with her life, pursuing new and worthwhile activities and leaving that old high school persona far behind her. So why do I love this book? Well, the beautiful writing transports me to a different place and time, and Emily is such a sympathetic and well-realized character. Also, the book, which is set over 100 years ago and was published in 1950, was ahead of its time. Emily reaches out to a group of Syrian immigrants who have settled on the outskirts of town. She's a natural feminist, and oh, did I mention the romance? Emily of Deep Valley and I have been good friends for over 40 years, and I love to visit with her over and over again. Emily of Deep Valley is a book I love so much, I have two copies, just in case one should get misplaced.